My name is Ronan Carr. I'm the Agricultural Advisor with Flins of Lackey here in Galway. I'm in a field of Magnum fodder beet, uh, which was sown in April 2017. And I'm here to describe the agronomy of the growing of the crop. It is a high dry matter beet with a dry matter of 19%, a leaf score of eight, and a tear score of four. It is probably the most popular fodder beet roots for feeding by both beef and dairy farmers. In March uh, 2017, uh, I came into the plot here and it was a soil sample to determine the pH of the soil and the P and K and trace elements required to grow the crop. Uh, the results came back. Uh, the pH was corrected with uh, 5 tonnes per hectare of ground limestone to bring the target pH up to 6.8. Uh, the beet compound in, we used was Goulding's A318 plus sulphur plus avail. The variety of beets sown here is Magnum. It was gaucho treated. Uh, the reason being is that the insecticide uh, Clopyrophos, which was sold as a doors ban, is gone off the market. Um, this is a safer way of protecting the crop from leather jackets and other soil borne pests. The plot here is owned and farmed by Michael and Keith Bork of Nocto Clare Galway. They are livestock and tillage farmers. They grow spring barley in rotation with fodder beet. This plot in question was in Spring Barley in 2015 and 16, and they sowed fodder beet here in 2017. The variety they chose was Magnum. The reason being is that because of it's been high in dry matter with a score of 19%, a leaf score of eight, which makes for ease of harvesting with a belt harvester. Uh, we control in fodder beet and sugar beet is normally a two spray program. Um, if I can roll you back to 2017, we've got a prolonged period of drought uh, April into early May. After the crop was sown, we did get a flush of weeds. Uh, but as a result of the drought, uh, the crop was stressed. All agricultural herbicides should be applied during active growing conditions. Uh, we didn't have that at the time. So instead of a two spray program, we got, got away with a robust one spray pro program and it worked. 